I have installed Wi-Fi camera inside the birdhouse over there. But there's a problem. The Wi-Fi coverage is very weak around the birdhouse. I cannot have a good video on my mobile phone. I will use this Wi-Fi repeater to repeat the Wi-Fi signal and place this Wi-Fi repeater inside of these glasses. Usually we will place this Wi-Fi repeater between the camera and the router. We will connect the camera to this Wi-Fi repeater and connect the Wi-Fi repeater to the router. We can easily use the Wi-Fi to connect the repeater to the router or we can use the cable to connect the repeater to the router. If we decide what with the Wi-Fi is important to know, the Wi-Fi repeater only works with 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi. If what you have is a dual band router, you need to log into your router and separate the 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi. Eventually, you should have two different Wi-Fi names from your router. We'll use the cable in this video. First, let's power up the Wi-Fi repeater. This is the power adapter. Let's connect to the power port of the Wi-Fi repeater. I will use this short punch code to link the Wi-Fi repeater to our home router. Now let's pop the camera. This is the outdoor ready power adapter. Let's connect to the power input of the camera and use this cat to lock the connection. Now let's move to the ad. From here, we choose other way to pair the network, device in the land. This is the Wi-Fi repeater. Let's click the repeater to watch the live video from the camera. We need to wait for a while before we can see the cameras on light. Now the camera's on light. Let me switch to the full screen. This is the 180p high definition video from the camera. I also can hear the audio from the camera. Hello? Hello? The camera is waterproof. Why the waterproof is so important? If the camera is not waterproof, the camera may get damaged after strong rain. We also can adjust the lens of the camera. Let me open the front cover and adjust the lens. You can adjust the lens to have the best focus from the camera. The camera equipped with neutral wide angle lens. Let me place the camera inside the birdhouse. We are seeing both sides of the camera. Actually, we can turn the camera 90 degree around like this. We can turn around to monitor the entrance of the birdhouse. If the bird flies through this entrance, we'll see it. We need to use this special bracket to turn around 90 degree so we can watch the entrance of the birdhouse. The Wi-Fi repeater also supports microSD card. This is the microSD card slot. We can install microSD card to save the live video from the camera. It's quite easier to share the bird box camera. As long as the camera is online, your friend and family can connect to the camera and watch the camera inventory. The last thing is about the power. This is the power data. If the power source is not available, we also can use this motorcycle battery. This is the cable designed to work with the motorcycle battery. This battery can survive four and five days before we need to recharge or swap the battery. All right, that's all for today's video. If you have any question, please post it in the comment section below. See you next time.